Hello, my name is Jerome Landry, and today I'm going to show you two new products created by Exfo for the inspection of MT type fiber. So these, new two, these two new products are MT type nozzles. These nozzles can be used to inspect either directly the MT type um, ferrule or also for MT type ferrule, which is in production for an M MPO type connector. So for those that are familiar with uh, multi-fiber inspection, uh, you will know that the procedure is pretty much exactly the same for the inspection of MT type fiber in comparison for MPO. So in this case, this would be the nozzle that would be used for the uh, inspection of MPO type fiber. Let me give you a quick demonstration on how to analyze MT type fiber. So since we're using an APC type ferrule over here, I'll be using the APC type nozzle. As you can see right here, there's a slight angle that is used for the APC. Another important point is that the MT type nozzle does not have any directions. The MPO had both key up and key down. In this case, we only have one direction, so we won't need to configure the, uh, the type of uh, orientation. So in this case, we are connected with the nozzle right now. The nozzle is connected to the MPO type tip. Uh, now what we need to do would be to put the APC type ferrule inside the nozzle. So the orientation to adapt would be uh, having a V. So you need to have this angle from the nozzle being the opposite from the one of the connector. So as I said, one angle, the other, that would do a V right there. So that's how you need to connect both of those together. There you go. Now, the ideal way to know if everything is connected correctly now would be to take a look at connector max over here. So I won't go through the different steps on how to pair your, F, your FIP435B with your unit, but just know that it is possible. It is something that we offer also for information. So now that we're paired with the FIP435B, we have the fiber connected. We just need to go through basic setups to make sure everything is fine and good for the uh, inspection of the MT type ferrule. So let's go through it real fast. So basically, uh, when you go to test settings over here in FIP, you would have the option to select either M uh, UPC or APC type uh, ferrule. In this case, APC is already selected, so we can already go through that. Now, the other option, we need to make sure that the uh, fiber type is multi-fiber. That has also been selected. Uh, we need to make sure that the subtype is MPO since we do offer inspection for OptiTap also. So uh, in this case, MPO is selected. Uh, as I've said previously, key up, key down is of no real importance over here since there's only one, uh, one configuration that's possible with this tip. And finally, the uh, last uh, option that we need to select, which is one of the most important one for MT type fibers or MPO in general, would be the configuration. So which is the fiber type one times 12, two times 12, one times eight. So these type of different configurations are all available on this menu right here. As you can see over here. So now let's go through the basic uh, test. As I've said, it's the exact same procedure as a MPO type tip. So there will be three different steps. You just need to follow the on-screen instruction. So here's how you hold the FIP. Hold it as though it was a gun and this was a trigger. So basically, first you need to make sure you're on the first, uh, first selection. You can see it right here. You need to make sure you're at one. For the capture, it's as simple as just clicking on this capture button. So let's click on it. There you go, it's waiting. Once that's done, it'll ask you to go to the second position. Second position, you just need to pull it. You'll feel it with the MF type tip. In this case, you just need to click on capture once again. And finally, when you're at the third position, when you're ready, it gives you the third position at the bottom. You just pull all the way through. There you go. You're at the third. You should be able to see the end of the fiber right here. Indeed. 
So we're ready for the capture. Focus is at maximum. We click on capture. So there you go. Simple as that. Processing captures right now. That means that all of the pictures were taken. The only thing that's left is for the data to come from the FIP 435B to the unit. So we can take everything off. So we can take off the MT type ferrule, the nozzle. So these are interchangeable. And then we have the MF tip, which is also possible to take out if you want to do some uh, single fiber inspection. I see a red color over here, so I know it's fail. Let's go check. And indeed, we have 12 of those fibers that are failing. If you need more information, you can contact Exfil. Thank you.